on the right. game because the judge is going to lose it. You have an unquestionable right to counsel that you retain for yourself. No matter what, it doesn't matter if you want to have counsel to go to the bathroom. You have right. it. And you right. don't get to he, use he, that he to, to impugn someone. Impugn someone for the fifth and impugn someone for retaining counsel. Does not Jesus. understand the Constitution, period. Apparently. It, is the he understands is the it. Audio... He just finds it really it's inconvenient willful ignorance. today. It's yeah, willful it's, ignorance. It's, 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 it's malice. It's malice. Bad faith. Your Honor, we've already heard other witnesses be asked about why they've retained an attorney uh, before they testify in this case. But in no, particular, not why this that they did. Ever why? It is cool. represented by the same law firm uh, that employs one of the defense experts. Um, so I believe that that goes to bias. Uh, no. I. Did you want to respond? No. The only. I think the only question that came up about a lawyer was when uh, Mr. Grosskreutz had filed the $10 million lawsuit, which is clearly bias evidence. We had, there was a hearing on that. Yeah. So well, there different. There was also uh, testimony by um, Mr. The photographer. Yeah. Uh, about his employing an attorney after his interview with the district attorney's office. I just, and Mr. So, De Bruyne explained. He explained why he had done that based on what he believed to be the conversations with Mr. Binger. It, the fact that somebody hires a lawyer in and of itself doesn't make them biased. Yeah, I, I don't see where, you know, he may do it for proprietary reasons. You People have received a lot of his material that I assume he has copyright uh, to. Whoops. I don't know. I'm just assuming, but he's a business person. So I don't know if he's got a, a, a corporate or He also was present at a riot. In that. I, the mere fact that he hired a lawyer, I don't see where he that had two cops bias. sniffing around for his camera. That he hired footage. a lawyer. Uh, he hired a lawyer to provide us with this evidence. It would be one thing if he hired a lawyer to organize the articles of incorporation for his business, and it had nothing to do with the evidence in this case. The lawyer was the intermediary that gave us this evidence. So that was the, that's normal. I that's presume, normal. and I'd like to ask. I presume that was Mr. Hernandez's choice not to give it to us directly. And again, there's been some testimony about him providing some things to the detectives by Dropbox and then not providing other things. And I'd like to probe that. And now in the yeah, middle of trial, right. And now in the middle of trial, suddenly we're getting a whole bunch more through an attorney. And so it's not just that he's hiring a random attorney, he's hiring an attorney that is with the same law firm as one of their expert witnesses. Who's that? Um, it's, is it Henry, is it Henry Burrish? I've got the name of the firm here, Your Honor, if I could have one Bur second. Bur Bur so what? Bur this Curly is Burrish is the firm. So what? Uh, they are a Madison. And the, def the defense has retained Peyton, P-E-Y-T-O-N, Engel, E-N-G-E-L, as an expert witness. He's employed by the same firm that also is representing this witness. So I think that that goes to bias. Do you have a, Zero an expert relevance. from a law firm? Is that what you're telling me? Am I understanding that right? The, the expert was did um, a phone dump. So they have an expert who does what you would describe as when the when uh, law enforcement takes a cell phone and does a, a, oh, a search of the phone. Sure. Okay. That's what he did. Okay. They they employ someone there to do it for anyone. And we used that person um, to do it for Mr. Rittenhouse. They did no legal work. And is that term for a lawyer client? Ah! Oh, no. Oh, my God. Oh, That's no. actually worse. You know, Extraction? If you, if you ask me to do a phone call, <laughs> in addition to thinking, huh? um, I would... Uh, I would have to go to somebody to comply. Um, this is a law firm, Your Honor, that's getting presumably paid by the defense for expert witness services and presumably paid by this witness to represent him. This is bordering. A commonality the, I think they'd have to actually, actually put this to the bias. lawyers. Now, you may see it this differently. Has the jury may see it differently, but I'd like to He's impugning this. the law and office. The jury can yep. calculate yes. how that affects yeah. the yes, of this witness. But it's again, it's not something where he's hiring an attorney he's also, to help him buy a piece of property or get him out of a divorce or something like that. He's it's hiring an attorney to help him talk to, to the, the prosecution. That he's testifying about in this case, it sounds which like is a already plan to me. Well, I, I, uh, I, I, how is that prejudicial? I just don't see that. No, 
I mean, I probably will allow this. I, I want to think about it for the next half hour. Um, he's going to take, he's gonna but, take lunch. Um, yeah. I don't know if we're just, if we're headed anywhere that's going to get us we're, something we're of not. value. Um, you, you're, you're introducing on the subject of bias, which of course is bias evidence is admissible sure. because it calls into credibility. The witnesses uh, calls into question the witnesses credibility. He's generally just presented videos. There has been some testimonial statement, but um, I, I'll permit it, I think somewhat, but um, you're talking about his employing a law firm and uh, for reasons we've already discussed, uh, there's going to be a limit. In fact, I think I shut down the somebody I was told not to inquire further on representation. Discussion with an attorney, I think it was Mr. Sharaf, as he asked about something and I wouldn't let him do it. Correct. So I, it's going to be a closely watched door. All right. Anything else? By everyone except for Mark okay, Richards is going to be asleep and objecting. Uh, let's hope for one o'clock. I don't know. The uh, hope the Asian food isn't coming. It's on. Isn't on one of those. Oh, boats. the Asian food. Oh, oh, at least he didn't call for racist. Oh my God. Washington, Washington Post. In 20 minutes, they're going to come out with a oh, <laughs> with an article. They, they probably will. That's that's how racist judge orders food. Oriental food oh, from the He said stand. he said Asian. He well, said no, Asian. Asian. <laughs> but like, <laughs> but he couldn't there. distinguish what kind, of course. Yeah, of course. He yes, said, yes, "Call right. up Mr. Korean, Chan Thai, and get me Chinese, some damn Chinese. egg rolls right on the stand." Oh my yeah. God, what a racist! Oh, 